Hey everyone, welcome back to Thursday Thoughts with Anthony, spring cleaning edition. And no, it's not about your basement or your garage, it's about cleaning up those financial things that it's always good to get ahead on for the year. And I've got three tips for you. The first one is kind of obvious, but it's something we don't think about often until the pile gets piled up, which is shredding old documents. Everybody has a different rule of thumb about how many years back you should keep things. I generally go about a couple years myself. But for stuff older than that, if you really want to dispose of it securely, shredding really is the way to go. Now, if you work with us, let us know if you have anything you want shredded. We may be able to help you depending on what it is and the quantity you're talking about. But getting things shredded and disposed of properly is tip number one. Number two... And this is something, again, if you worked with us, we may have already looked at in the last 6 to 12 months. But it's making sure your beneficiaries are up to date. And I'm actually going to even add on to that. Maybe even it's time to look at your will or your health care directive or your power of attorney. It's top of mind for me because my wife and I just went through this, getting our will updated. And it's a pretty painless process, but it is something you're going to want to do every you know, five years, maybe even 10 years. Beneficiaries are something you want to be updated always. So if you're worried that you're not up to date and you work with us, get in touch with us. But if you don't work with us, make sure your beneficiaries on all your accounts are up to date and that you know who they are. And then lastly, number three, after doing your taxes, we just passed tax day, it's a great time to get those taxes analyzed. And again, for those people that work with us, you're actually going to get a note from us about this very soon, telling you how to send us your tax return so that they can be analyzed. Now, you may work with an accountant who does some sort of analysis beyond just filing the taxes, and that's great. But I encourage everybody to get their taxes analyzed. Not It's not about getting them filed per se. It's about looking forward to now 2024 and what could we do different or more importantly, do better to save ourselves money going forward. So those are our three spring cleaning tips. Tune in next week for another edition of Thursday Thoughts.